what's up guys it's covert code here and in today's video i'm going to be teaching you guys how to script on roblox now this is a question that many new developers have when they join the platform but to answer this question you need to understand what scripting is and all scripting is is essentially using a programming language and roblox's programming language is called lua okay and you use that language in a specific way to make specific things and that's where most people um, are confused because you need to know exactly when to type certain things because if you don't then it might not work or it'll break now there are different ways you can learn how to script um, personally nowadays the number one method to um, learning how to script is through YouTube tutorials and I have a playlist called the Zero to Hero series and it's designed for beginners like you who don't have a clue on how to script and essentially take you from zero to hero. Which means you'll be taken from an absolute beginner um, to uh, essentially a good scripter. Now the second method you can use to learn how to script is the Roblox Wiki. I cannot stress this enough. So many people don't even know about this, let alone how to use it, okay? I have a tutorial on this, how to use the Roblox Wiki. It's this massive repository of information made by Roblox themselves, by the way, um, and other contributors, okay? And it's, it's such a good resource for you to use. If you don't know how to, for example, make a part spin, you would literally search up part and it'll tell you anything you need to know about part and they also have tutorials with code included so if you don't know how to make something or if you're looking on how to make an obby or a kill part or something like that that is available in or on the roblox wiki itself and i still use this till this day okay like when i'm confused about something i that's the number one place i go if i don't know how something works i'll search that up read about it, then I'll know how it works. So keep that in mind, the Roblox Wiki, make sure to check out the tutorial I did on how to use that, because you need to learn um, or know how to actually understand what they present to you. The third method is experimenting with free models. Now, free models have this negative aura around them. You shouldn't be scared to use free models. Yes, um, most of them have um, what people like to call viruses, are not actually viruses, but um, you know, they have malicious scripts and you should be careful, yes, but when you're just starting out, if you don't know how to make a gun or you don't know how to make a sword or something like that, just go to the free model section, drag a sword into your game or a gun, and if it works, just go open up the scripts which that model has and you can read through the code and see exactly what the developer of that weapon um used or wrote up to make that function and then that way you can analyze um, how you could do the same thing that's actually one of the main ways i learned how to script just experimenting with new things and seeing how other people wrote their code now the final way you can learn how to script is by challenging yourself um try and pick things to work on that you don't know how to make and yes you can use all of the above methods to make something that you don't know how to make um but picking some stuff which you don't know how to make will actually help you uh, grow as a developer and as a scripter. Because then um, you go from knowing nothing to knowing a few things and you go all the way to knowing a lot of things and that's what you want. Don't go for the easy route, just try, make the hard things. Once you learn that, the other things will be easy, okay? And as a bonus tip, I just want to tell you guys to start small. Don't go for massive, overcomplicated things. Go for small things that you don't know how to make and then grow from there, okay? You don't want yourself to give up um, on this journey that you're going on. Um, and that's because you don't really know what you could have accomplished um, if you hadn't given up. So that's all I had, guys, for this video. Um, if you like this video, leave a like. And if you have any suggestions about what videos I should make next, leave a comment in the comment section down below. And I'll see you guys next time.